Okay, so just over three years ago, I dropped 14,000 diamonds on a brand new Boom Beach account. Well, you guys absolutely love this video, and after hearing rumors requesting round two, I've decided to once again make this brilliant investment. Enjoy the video. Oh, and uh, use code COSMIC in the shop. Okay, everyone, it is time to purchase our 14,000 diamonds, $99.99 worth of diamonds. Let's purchase it. And we're all set. Our purchase was successful. Let's hop into this. Now, uh, at this low level, we are currently on my Cosmic Dose account. And uh, I've played on this a handful of times. I I'm kind of nervous for this. I know I've already done this before, but uh, it, it doesn't cool the nerves here. So uh, let's just start off uh, upgrading some landing crafts as much as we can. Because, uh, you know, on, on my uh, main account... I, I always waited a long time to upgrade the landing crafts because they were extremely expensive. Now I don't really have to uh, wait for it and it looks like we got our landing crafts max for the level. Let's hop onto the gunboat now. So I'm going to try and thread in a couple of attacks as the video goes on but it's mainly going to be upgrading. Let's just upgrade our storages right now. Might as well here so um... We're just trying to get to, uh, I, I guess we can upgrade the HQ. I thought I had to be level 9 to get it. I guess I am level 9. So, uh, let's see. We have to get to level 11 next. So let's just upgrade the, uh, radar. And actually, I have a little bit of wood I can spend. So we don't have to be instant training it. But I want to get my vault upgrade. Protect our loot. Even though we're just diamonding things right now. Down to 2,000 wood. But we do have a lot of gold. Let's go upgrade the armory here. Can we upgrade it twice? No only once um now what i want to upgrade is i am going to go upgrade my heavies because uh we want to get some heavy zooka attacks in today if we can looks like they're maxed for the level we're gonna see what we can all place down here we'll get that sniper tower we'll get the mortar down we'll diamond that one up let's go see it looks like we got a machine gun it's gonna cost us a little bit of diamonds to uh, just place it down with the with the wood but now we can get a sculptor so we can start collecting our power stones and getting some uh, statues down so that's pretty exciting I think I have to uh, put some mines down here um, it's gonna cut it, it, it's extra clicks they're kind of annoying but um, since I upgraded the HQ we'll go over and we will upgrade our landing crafts here and by the end of the video I think I'm gonna try and level off around five 500 diamonds because I do want a little bit of spending power. I do not have the subscriptions or the boosters on here, so uh, yeah, I kind of want to save some for troop training and all that. Uh, now, do I upgrade all my landing crafts? Looks like we did, so we'll hit the gumbo. Actually, no, we're H we're we're level 11, so we'll get that HQ upgrade. Um, now, now looking at the comments last time I did this video a few years ago, it seems there was some confusion, and I I gotta state, no, I am not wasting my parents' money. Uh, and second question, yes, I am wasting my money, so uh, that that should clear some things up there. And uh, I, I guess we're looking at the trader right now. We're going to let her sit. And I wonder if we're going to trade with her. I don't know if she'll take it too personally. But we're going to diamond that up. Try and get our units down. Looks like we got our first cannon in the construction zone. So we'll diamond that up. And I can't seem to click right now. Which is a little bit unfortunate. Because I need to, I need to be able to click uh, to diamond some stuff up. So we'll get our first, I, I believe first? Uh, yeah, first stone storage. I wasn't even able to capture stone before, but I guess we're gonna have to leave it at level one until we do get that HQ upgrade, and we can get another landing craft, another one, and we'll get all these landing crafts up to max level. Now I can hit uh, some bases with two boats of heavies, two bo boots, two boots of zookas, um, two landing crafts of zookas. We'll get that gunboat upgraded. Uh, we'll get. And we'll get this final landing craft upgraded. So we have um, about 11,500 diamonds left here. Just under after we get that upgrade. We'll upgrade it one more? Yeah, there we go. And uh, honestly, right now, we're going to load up our troops. We're going to get two boats of heavies. 
and then two boat Suzukas, and we're gonna we're gonna try and smack some low level players here because I'm only at 19 medals. I actually just got demoted when I logged back onto this account. I was like, oh, the pain. But uh, we'll we'll just expand our map here, collect those diamonds, extra spending three diamonds. Let's go. We're 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 making a return on our investment here. I'm I'm excited about that. Ooh, two more diamond chests, three more. Let's go. And we just have a ton of NPC bases to take out, but that's kind of boring. So we're gonna let them be. And uh, looks like we have an achievement here. So might as well collect it. Extra ten diamonds. I am being greedy right now. I'm being a kleptomantic with the uh, with the I think this is a player base, but it wasn't showing the rank head. Does that mean they just aren't high enough rank to, to like have a label or whatever? I don't even know. But we're just gonna throw down our heavies, throw down our Zookas, our artillery. We have not upgraded in the armory yet, so if we were to throw it onto the HQ, it would just tickle it a little bit and not really do anything. But since um, I got max landing craft and uh, some upgraded troops here, I think we can just stomp all over this level 11 um in this attack pretty basic stuff when it comes to low level heavy zuki you kind of just chill there i know i wasted my gbe i was just making a demonstration for you folks that uh, haven't played at this low of level in a while as that's uh that that's essentially me since i spend uh i would say 95 percent of my time on my main account uh, we're gonna throw an artillery that should tickle the mortar just a little bit and it'll get destroyed Now we're just gonna throw a flare into the HQ get our zookas onto it It doesn't really pay for them to take out that armory even though they did get it to 1 HP and there we go Taking out a level 11 and when we go, ooh, we got steam roller on us. That is another achievement We are making we're making some diamonds back. Let's go. Let's go upgrade our troops. What do we do? Oh, I guess uh, we have to upgrade our armory first. That would make sense. Uh, can we get a second? No, looks like like we'll just get uh ooh, we're starting to get to the expensive upgrades here 150 diamonds i'll pop but i'll take it because uh our our uh our heavies and zookas they're worth it they're worth it we need xp uh wait what did it say 14 yeah so i just need uh one more level here where is my radar we need to upgrade this puppy here twice if we can three times no looks like we left it off at twice and now we are just gonna try and explore we'll take those two diamonds in our supply chest and uh, we're kind of out of gold now, but that doesn't matter because we got these diamonds so Let's just expand our map as much as we can um, And it looks like we'll be able to uh, Uncover our first resource base. Am I gonna attack it? I am not and we got dr. T There we go, and uh, you know this this archipelago just got a little bit more evil. You guys see that? Radar level 7, and we are going to be able to uh, get Hammerman HQ. I don't even know. It's been so long, I don't even know what level they start out at. A little bit, uh, a little bit saddening there, but we, we need to upgrade our defenses. What are we doing? This is not just an attack-based game. We need to defend a little... I mean, I guess to a certain extent, um, you can just get away with... Uh, pushing on attacks, but we're gonna upgrade our sniper towers uh, Get that cool little green skin on them, and then they look a little bit more intimidating I guess it's a little bit blue there. We need to upgrade it one more time. There we go level 7 level 7 That means we don't have to upgrade it. So um, At least until the next HQ level we are down to 9857 diamonds as I spend uh yeah, that that amount change. Let's upgrade our vault. We can upgrade that once I guess I, I was gonna say twice But now we are just gonna move on to the defenses even though it, the defenses aren't the fun things to upgrade here But that doesn't matter. We gotta we gotta be we gotta be wise Upgraders here. We gotta be wise diamonders. Uh, let's upgrade the residents here They they're just chilling with that green upgrade button like uh, they mean some uh, I guess they do mean some you know they're they're residents of our uh, cosmic dose village so uh, might as well give them a, a better place to live um, so there we go got that up to a respectable level we'll get the sawmill up too and then uh, looks like we'll be able to upgrade the HQ again I'll probably get uh, after this one maybe one more HQ upgrade and then the the um, what you call it wait I can repair this now let's repair it let's get our let's get our uh, hero hut uh, kind of chilling there 
Um, wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? I didn't mean to click on the trader there. Uh, but here we go. Let's upgrade our HQ. Almost 200 diamonds there. Starting to get a bit expensive. We'll take that gold. Looks like we can get it again. Might as well. And we, uh, we, we unlock some more troops. So that's pretty exciting here. Let's, let's look at our new, our, our new, uh, our troop. The Warriors don't have smoke right now. Um, I don't think. When do, when do I get smoke unlocked? Let's check the armory. HQ level. Level 14 headquarters required. We are at level 8. So, uh, uh, quite a ways to go on that end. And we are down to 6,790 diamonds here. So I'm going to upgrade the radar two times, I believe, to HQ levels. We're going to upgrade the sculptor. It looks like we can only upgrade that once and now we move on to the landing crafts instant get them on uh, looks like uh, level 8 there so that's pretty cool um, there we go and now the upgrades are starting to get a bit more expensive not max level expensive but uh, consistent amount of diamonds are being uh, expended onto these upgrades here so there we go we'll be able to train up two more of each troop so that's pretty dope and now we'll upgrade our gunboats and what I want to do is upgrade my artillery in the uh, in the armory after we do upgrade the armory of course um, there we go we're just gonna we're gonna upgrade our heavies our zookas and our artillery for now and then we're gonna let the armory be for the remainder I believe I don't know I might go back on my word here and uh, you know but we're, we want to get that artillery upgrade. I guess we can upgrade shock bombs too. Uh, that's kind of tempting. Um, and it looks like my subconscious mind upgraded it without uh, without uh, any regard. But there we go. Saw a brick there. Uh, that means our hero hut is repaired. So we're going to be able to bring a hero into battle here. As we do max out our artillery. And we are down to about... 2,000 diamonds so I'm gonna spend 1,500 more uh, we're gonna go we are gonna um, upgrade brick might as well instant man we, we are getting low on diamonds here uh, I gotta say you know like I said at first the upgrades uh, I'm gonna leave brick be we're, we're gonna let her sort out her own issues now but as I said, the upgrades quickly get more expensive. We are at 1,500 diamonds, just under, um, actually just under 1,600, I should say. But uh, kind of leaving the map. -y. Let's start attacking some bases. Looks like we're out of gold, so we are going to need to spend some. And now we're just going to throw down our heavies, throw down our zookas, throw down our hero, and uh, just kind of snipe things with our max level artillery um, for the level. I should say for the armory level because not even close to max level here uh, doing a pretty good job we got a decent amount of I just threw an artillery onto the beach I was trying to click I was trying to click uh, the the cluster grenade but it looks like my thumb had a different agenda so we're gonna throw an artillery onto those three buildings hit only two but we should be able to take out the HQ we'll do we'll do like two or three attacks here and then we'll spend the remainder of our diamonds and uh, wrap this wrap this uh, video up here so Hubbard we are gonna take out take you out 19 medals my friend you know I, I gotta groom my base like you I did right before recording but then I ran out of trees to take out because I needed to be a higher level but I'm fine with my base right now I we can place down what can we place down I haven't been paying attention to this so we'll get a gold storage down we'll worry about the upgrading later we'll get another residence down I just hate seeing that we can place buildings down and then we'll get our quarry down so we'll be able to produce some stone here looks like that's enough for sport uh puts don't judge my base design i'm not i'm not uh editing it right now there we go put down the rest of the mines Ooh yeah uh, get our mortar down and we are still at 1500 so no big deal on the diamond end and get another cannon down Look at that look at how good of a base design that is the HQ is over here Most of my defenses are over there a low level. So um, Let's retrain our troops here. Is that it then when do I get a landing craft? Uh, HQ level 9 uh, I want to get it should I just upgrade it get an extra landing craft because then I can get my submarine and flamethrowers, I kind of want to do it. Might as well. 
Might as well. And then uh, we have something to work with once we start getting our own loot. So we're gonna we're gonna diamond that up. We'll get our landing craft. We'll get our submarine. Oh, that's a lot of diamonds. And we'll get a flamethrower. 143. Let's go. I am worrying about it though. And we'll get an iron storage. So we th this was pretty successful here. 737. I'm just gonna upgrade our. Uh, what do I want to upgrade? Might as well just upgrade the sculptor here and that is gonna be the remainder of my spending let's hop into a couple of attacks here my i'm just gonna load this up with zookas we'll take the two extra diamonds up and let's hop into two player base attacks here and wrap today up um interesting interesting design you know kind of kind of got my vibe going with the defenses on one side and the hq on the other not really protect anything uh but he does have the ice statue so i don't know could be in for a surprise here low level ice statue never know um but we're gonna pop a cluster grenade and we are gonna shock the mortar just in case it had any ideas to try and go for my zookas there we don't want to put our zookas through that kind of stress yet even though i just let a cannon free hit on them as our heavies are attacking the hq and our zookas are just going for surrounding defenses we'll throw a flare finish off this incredibly easy base and hop into our final attack for today there we go we got the conqueror and uh we'll i, I guess we'll we got a little bit of extra diamonds to diamond up our troops. Um, there we go. We only lost one one Zuka there. One too many though. I could have prevented it. it. Looks like we have two. We we have two uh, two achievements we can collect. I'll take it. Sitting at 491 diamonds, and it is gonna be 488 here. There we go. Um, let's go to Dr. T. You know, my, let's just let's just uh, hit Dr. T until we lose here. Might as well. I mean, Cycle Evil, he gives some he gives some good power stones out. Uh, so I, I, I would appreciate that. It's kind of just letting our, our heavies go off. Tank as much as they can as our Zookas pick up some more free energy. That mortar close, that mortar, that mortar shell got awfully close to my Zookas there. A little bit nerve wracking, but we're going to throw a shock. Make sure we disable the mortar. And as the, those machine guns just poke down the, the triple heavies there, um, throw another shock bomb out. And honestly, we'll just throw some artillery into that four cluster. Take it out. And and, uh, you know, this level 10 Dr. T base ain't got none on me. Might be able to take out stage 7. No, I'm just kidding here. Uh, but it looks like we got that payback. We will get another achievement. Achievement galore today here. Payback 25 diamonds. That, that's pretty good. Let's, uh, let's hit a level 20 Dr. T. See, see if we are able to take him out. It switched to Volcano Island now, so uh, that was a little bit questionable there. It, it had me confused for a second. Um, but we're going to try and capture some of that free energy. Uh, throw a cluster grenade to hopefully clear it out, even though Brick's just so far back there. Um, she, she ain't firing it yet. You know, our, our heavies are taking out the free energy quick enough. There we go. Look at that cluster grenade. Nice. Um, but uh, as we capture this free energy, we're going to have... We're gonna have around 60 energy by the end of this. Um, depending on what steps into the flamethrower range, we might have to throw a shock bomb onto it. I'm gonna do a redirect flare. Make sure my heavies don't go too far into no man's land. And I think I should be able to take out this base here. Assuming I play my cards correctly here. We're gonna throw a shock bomb onto that cluster. Make sure the the uh, cannon doesn't hit too hard on my heavies. We're going to throw a few med kits. Now, my med kits are extremely low level, so they're not that effective, but I just want to have some sustain for the... Excuse me, for the uh, flamethrower damage that was done. But we're, we're clearing in a good pocket for my Zookas to sit and, uh, you know, eventually take out this base. I'm getting a little bit nervous with that flamethrower cannon. As they do turn into my Zookas, we will lose one of them, unfortunately. Now we kind of have to worry about that mortar. Throw a shock bomb onto it. Uh, we missed the flamethrower. Looks like the flamethrower is not even in range, so I'm not going to stress about it too much. And we have an absurd amount of energy right now, so we're going to throw a few artillery out, try and clear it out. And boom, there goes 
uh, Dr. T's Volcano Island level 20. But let's just expose this area since we do have the gold. We'll kind of chill with HQ 25 Hammerman, of course, and we'll we'll do a video on that eventually, but uh, I'm kind of ahead of the game right now, so I don't think it'll be too difficult for my level. Actually, let's scout it out. I might, I might be talking too soon here. He's got, they, they got the super mortar, so that just does a ton of damage. I do have shock bombs at a pretty high level, so I guess I could just throw down on this side, flare up, and keep that super mortar shock, so nah, uh, that, that's kind of a good plan. So we'll leave it be for now, uh, that we'll... We'll save it for a rainy day. But if you guys did enjoy me wasting $100 worth of diamonds, be sure you guys do drop a like. Um, yeah, we'll see you in tomorrow's Boom Beach video. Bye-bye.